Well, that was our goal, um, being one of the only teams and until Shannon could compete last year for America East Championship, we knew we were one of the only teams that could compete for one. So being able to be competitive in the conference was obviously our first goal, um, which we were the year before, and we just missed out on, on winning by a couple of points. Um, so winning that second year became really, really important to us, and uh, winning it meant a lot, I think, to everybody in the department, kind of validated the move to Division One and, and showed everybody that we could be competitive at that level. You know, coming so close the year before, you know, pretty much our only goal, and uh, I think our sports information department made me say it, uh, or tried to make me say it a few times, and I never really told them that that was it. I mean, that was the goal for the year, anything besides winning that championship would have been a disappointment. Um, so winning it was great, and now we can move forward and try to be competitive in the conference every year, and hopefully competitive in the region sometime down the road. Every program's first Division I win was really important. Uh, every program's first conference win was really important. Uh, and for the men's cross country team last year to capture uh, the conference's first uh, uh, championship uh, was pretty special. I had the thrill of being there at Stony Brook when they won it. Um, and any time um, you're the first to accomplish anything, it's memorable. And that was certainly memorable for cross country and memorable for me. I started back in the early 90s and uh, was with the cross country, men's cross country team when they won their first ever Division II national championship. So uh, that was in uh, much colder temperatures and uh, in Indiana, but uh, this one was uh, certainly much more accommodating in terms of the weather, but equally as exciting. Our secondary goal after winning the championship was to be ranked high in the region, which we finished last year, I think, eighth or ninth in the region. Um, you know, our long-term goal is, is to have a chance to win a conference championship every single year, um, and then hopefully be in the top five or six in the region every year. Um, if you're a top five, six in the region any year, every year, you have a chance hopefully to move on to the NCAAs at some point. Um, that's really the goal. The next step in the process for us is to try to be in that top five, six in the region. For the men's team, um, we're a lot younger than we were a year ago. Um, we've chosen to redshirt four of our top six returners from a year ago, um, knowing that we're eligible to go to the NCAA regionals. A year from now, that was a choice that the kids and the team and the other coaches and I made. Um, our goal this year is one again, once again to be competitive inside the conference. If we can do that with this, this young group and then bring those four guys back next year, uh, we feel like we're in a really good spot, not just inside the conference, but inside the region as well. So the goal for this year is, is just to stay in you know, the top, you know, top couple of teams. And if we can do that this year, then we feel like that was a really successful year for what we decided to do looking forward.